In this video, we'll be doing a geometry word problem. The problem that we're doing is the length of a rectangle is 2 inches more than the width. If the length and the width are each increased by 3 inches, the perimeter of the new rectangle will be 4 inches less than 8 times the width of the original rectangle. Find the dimensions of the original rectangle. So that's a lot of words. We're going to break it up into pieces. First of all, I'm going to draw a sketch so that I can label it with my variables. I have uh, two rectangles, the original one, and then a new one that's a, a little bit bigger. Um, I'm going to call this my width and this my length. So I'll use W and L. Now the first sentence says that the length of the rectangle is two inches more than the width. So I know then that I can translate this. The length is two more than the width. So now I can use this dimension for my length and this dimension for my width. Then the second sentence says the length and the width are each increased by three. So and I'll stop there so that I can label my new rectangle. If I increase my width by three, I now have W plus three as the width of my new rectangle. And if I increase my length by three, I'll have 2 plus w plus 3, which is w plus 5. Now this is the length of my new rectangle, and this is the width of my new rectangle. Then continuing this sentence, it says the perimeter of the new rectangle. So the perimeter of the new rectangle is going to be the sum of all four sides. So, or you can use the formula, but I'll just go ahead and write um, this side is going to be w plus 5, and this side will be w plus 3. So I have w plus 3 plus w plus 5 plus w plus 3 plus w plus 5. So my perimeter of my new rectangle is 4w plus 16. Then let's go ahead and do this again and get our equation. The perimeter of the new rectangle, which is p sub nu, will be, so that's where our verb is, so equals 4 inches less than, so I have to scoot over and put minus 4 because I'm going to subtract 4 from something, 8 times the width of the original rectangle. Now here's my original rectangle and this is my width, so I want 8 times the width of the original. Right, now I can go ahead and uh, sub in my perimeter of my new, we said was 4w plus 16. And that equals 8w minus 4. Let's go ahead and solve. I have the bigger 8w on the right side, so I'm going to subtract 4w from both sides, so cancel, and I have 4w on the right side now, and minus 4, and then add 4 to both sides, and so cancel, and I have 20 is equal to 4w, and then divide by 4, and so cancel, and I have 5 is equal to w. Now from this little equation right here, I know that my length is 2 more than the width. So length equals 2 plus w. 
I can put that in there and get a length which is 2 plus 5. My length is 7. So the problem asks us to find the dimensions of the original rectangle which was W and L. So my dimensions are 5 inches by 7 inches.